Hi guys, today I'm walking from home. I thought let me actually bring you along a day in my life as a PCN, um, which is Pomori Care Network Pharmacist. So what I'm doing today is um, I'm literally just doing lots of admin work so I'm trying to be on top of what I need to do what needs to be done before November and everything like that and there's a lot of work with it it's on the CPP uh, primary care pathway so that's what I am working on first thing today I will then move on to listen to or watch the video on the new system because you know in healthcare there's always this system of computer that you use so i'm trying to watch a video to get used to that system youtube page i've been watching to learn how to use the system one this system one is like it's so analog <laughs> it's not digital I don't know even that they call it digital but it's it's actually very complicated with a lot of things going on in it so it, it actually deserves a whole day of learning on its own but one thing my manager did say is that um it would translate in time where i just actually practice what i learned on the youtube on the system so it's like a slow um like a steady introduction into work instead of just going in and feeling like you're alone in the middle of an ocean I think I'll do that for another two hours and then I'll go back to the CPP and continue um, doing some admin work. So I'm just going to be doing mainly those two today alongside my home thing when I'm on a break or something. My plan is actually try and be on top of work before tomorrow so I can have all the questions I want to ask. So I'm sort of setting up my calendars because there's a lot of training days, there's a lot of e-learnings and Zoom trainings that I have to attend and put it on my calendar so I can let my manager know. So when they are planning my route, they know that these days I am not in. I can, I'm doing like a learning, um, I'm on training, I can't be at work, but I'm studying at home. So that's what it is. But it's been good so far working from home. Um, I actually love it, but I'm also looking forward to going to work tomorrow. I think after working from, from home for almost more than seven days now, I think I am more of an hybrid person rather than just be at home for the longest time. So. yep um that's me enjoying it i'm not complaining i'm not but yeah Hi guys, so as you can see, I just finished lunch, but would I call that lunch? Because I only had cake and custard and 
that's just what I'm feeling like. I don't feel like a heavy food because I'm going to church later for 6 30. I don't want to be too heavy, so I don't go to church and be sleeping. I'm actually done for the day in terms of work work but work doesn't finish until 5 30 so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna do my own thing from five o'clock I'm going to actually pick up my outfit for work tomorrow because it's my first day I wanted to look nice and presentable you know not those lock home days where you just can't be bothered you just dress anyhow to work but this one because it's more of a GP surgery you have to be well presentable you'll be seeing patients sometimes so I have to look like professional like corporate wears I got some few um, sets of new houses from Shane or Shane whatever anyone calls it um, I'm gonna just get them out of their bags I've actually not, not unraveled the things I bought from Shane yet I might unravel it but I'm not gonna try them on because I still don't know how to do trying on clothes because I don't want to show my body so but I'll lend that but yeah I'll just show you what I got but I'm not gonna try them on and then decide what I'm gonna wear tomorrow let me show you something here my father can really really improvise things and by the way I got a TV in my room now so trust me you don't see me outside again <laughs> of this room but yeah let me show you what my father improvised that man is a genius i think well i'm also a genius too thinking of father that i'm his daughter you know, it's his let me show you how he improvised my mirror you see this mirror <laughs> my dad literally used a bag and do to sort of make it stand um i've always wanted i had i wanted the mirror i was thinking to get a long one and things like that but funny enough i just don't want because my room is getting so packed already and i don't want another extra thing in this room so i got this um, and since we had this from our previous home where we used to live and everybody else had the mirror in their home place and nobody else needed it as i'm the only female in this house so i decided to make use of the one we had from our previous place and it's actually standing before i used to put it on that on that chest of drawer that's why I didn't mind the hammer there. I was literally doing DIY yesterday um, on this chest of drawer, but it's much more better now this way. And this was the chest of drawer that I was DIYing myself yesterday. It doesn't look straight. I feel like something needs to be done to it, but I can't be bothered. At least it does the job. And and yeah, that's that's it. guys i am getting ready to go to church um church is at 6 30 but because of the way the journey is i have to go now so i can meet up on time when i get back we'll pick up the house fit for work tomorrow I am done for the day. It's currently seven minutes past five. It's been a very good day. I, I, to be fair, I made the best decision with this job I took. Um, I know with traveling, that could be the only downside for me at the moment. But I get to at least explore and get on the boats, which I'm taking. It's literally just five minutes. I'm at my area, so I'm. Um, 
really thankful for the job. I'm grateful to God. Yeah. I get to dress up as well. Got my outfit for today. But yeah. Hi guys, I hope you're all doing great. So I thought I should actually find the time to sit down and talk to you guys because I've just been bringing out on my first few days. Um my my days um uh, working as a GP. I've tried my best to carry it along, but of course because it's a GP surgery and at the moment I'm shadowing someone there's only so much time I can hold a camera while doing things. But I've just it's been really really good. Um I really enjoyed my experience um so far so good um have i got any negatives no not to, not at all maybe because i have actually not started officially by myself and i'm just shadowing maybe but i can't speak on any negatives at the moment um however yeah like one of the downside for me was that the traveling um because I know when I talk to her, this is where they're like, oh, is that not far from you? But I'm like, it's not, it's doable by 36 minutes drive. But because I don't drive yet, and I'm still in the process, and the only slot I found is January 14, thanks to COVID backlog. Um, so I'm going to be commuting at the moment. But as God will have it, my first day in yesterday, I spent two hours, 30 minutes to get to work, and two hours, 30 minutes back. It is quite long. That's on, almost five hours on the road trying to get to work but from today for me because this is why like i i just kept on praying to god that god i want to to just help me i really love this job i don't want a situation where i have to leave this job or leave the people i'm working with that i really feel at peace with because of travel god do something and god just raised someone to just mention that i could actually take a ferry from somewhere which you have seen or you've seen or you would see actually cut the journey from literally two hours 30 minutes to one hour 30 minutes a whole hour the, the ferry literally literally took five minutes something that would have taken me a whole hour to get where i'm going changing you know lots of time on the train and you get really tired and exhausted just took a ferry of five minutes to just cross the the cross the water crossing and i'm at the other hand immediately so i tried the ferry um it was one hour 30 minutes so on monday i'm gonna try and um, i'm gonna keep using the ferry but i'm going to try and see how i can cut short my journey from the ferry um, exit on the other hand instead of having to be on the bus for 45 to one hour i will see if i can try and cut it short by taking the train that only takes seven minutes for me to get to my workplace uh my workplace station and then i just walk about 20 minutes which i don't mind to just get my steps in my daily steps in anyways so i'm getting there i'm really really enjoying it of course as i start to ease into more of the roles i will start um having more content to show what my typical day is like but mainly all i've been doing this week was train um this past few weeks was training um and shadowing um last yesterday i went to a different farm um different surgery to shadow uh, my lead pharmacist and it was really good i learned a lot i learned a lot and then today we went to another another um surgery sorry in case i mentioned pharmacy pharmacy i'm not used to the aspect of the fact that i now work in a gp surgery i just my brain just picks it up like i'm working in a pharmacy but it's actually in a gp surgery i have my own space i have my own office space i do my work and everything so yeah it's been it's been really good and um i'm gonna try and create more content but yeah guys thank you so much for coming along with me on this my first few weeks as a pcn pharmacist